morning everybody today is monday april 15 2019 i hope everybody had an awesome weekend the markets opened very flat basically even from where they closed on friday and not much action going on right now not too surprised that's the way it's been for me and my strategy for the past month or so maybe a little bit longer but as always, we're gonna be patient and wait for our signals here. Um, I did check Forex Factory, nothing much going on on the docket. Um, we do have a member speaking, but that's later in the day. So let's see if the markets can get going, start ramping up. We need to trade, we need to make money, guys. I'm really contemplating buying some puts here. 289.50 puts. Alrighty, I bought three. 289.50 puts that expire in two days bought them at 99 cents i realized that i didn't get a signal here um just something about it is telling me to go ahead and buy and i got the uh, finger on my on the uh, trigger here to get out in case it completely starts reversing on me my thought here is if it gets back up to um 289.52 range i'll cut loose I literally sold at even money here. Um, I only lost commission here. Let me show you the uh, trade that I placed here. Bought three at 99 cents and sold three at 99 cents. And it just wasn't wanting to go from here. Maybe I sold prematurely, but I just didn't want to chance it. It just didn't seem like you know it, it had the juice here. I bought a little high, I bought, you know, relatively speaking, I bought um, right as I bought into the move instead of uh, actually, you know, and it stalled out, it just, I just didn't like it. And then on top of that, oh, I guess you can't see it, but I've been getting this message here, streamer connection loss, you're no longer connected to Tastyworks, please, please check your internet connection. Uh, for some reason, it won't transfer over here, but... Um, let's see what happens from here. No harm, no foul, guys. I lost uh, commission, which is three bucks. whoop de doo What's going on, everybody? It's Giovanni here from Spy Options Trading. It's Monday, TGIM. You guys know I love Mondays. I love Mondays. You love Mondays. We all love Mondays. As you saw there, I did place a trade, but I broke 100% even on that trade except for commission fees of course which you can negate um but i'm really disappointed i'm really dis disappointed because first of all i didn't get a signal and i shouldn't have been trading first of all i have to be a more disciplined trader if i want to do this for a living even though that it actually ended up going in my direction and i actually ended up selling too soon but i was able to recognize the potential there but still i did not get a signal now, if you go back to the video, you'll see that I actually got a signal, a really good signal on Facebook. This is what I'm mad about, and I'm really disappointed in myself. I saw the signal, I contemplated, I thought about it in my head, but just something was telling me don't trade Facebook, even though all of my criteria was there. Um, not only just the arrow itself, but everything was pointing in the right direction. And I didn't trade it. I did see, I can't remember exactly which puts I was looking at, but I could have bought them at $1.50 and they went up to two bucks. I should learn to trust my signals. Even whenever I, I get it in a, in a bad trade, I have my exit strategy in case of bad, bad signals that are gonna cover me. I'm gonna limit my losses and I need to let my winners run essentially. But I'm really disappointed in today, not because I placed a trade and broke even and didn't necessarily make money. I was just disappointed because I broke my rules left and right today. Um, I traded when I didn't get a signal. And then the one that I did get a signal, I didn't trade. That's bad, bad, bad stuff there, guys. But I'm going to get back into the routine of things. With that being said, there's an issue with that. I have to work full days for the next week. Um, at my day job because my bosses are going out of town. They're going on vacation. So I am left to um, basically man down uh, the forts. 
and that's going to be for the next week. So what I'm trying to say here is more than likely I'm going to be doing a lot of recaps if I do place a trade. I'll be doing recaps. I'll be showing you what signal I got when and what I traded. It'll be you know, the after effect, you won't actually see me a, hey, you know what, I'm looking to get in and getting in and whatnot. It, they're going to be recaps, even though I hate recaps. It's the only way that I can do that. I can show you my trades for the next week or so. If I can, I'll sneak in a video in there of me actually trading at my day job, but we'll see how that goes guys. So no promises there. Comment down below everybody what you thought about this video. If you have any suggestions, any advice, I would greatly appreciate it. We're all here to help each other out guys. I'm here to help you guys out anyways. Let me know what you uh, traded today, what you made money on, what you lost money on, what you need help with. You can also email me any questions. I'll put my email in the uh, description down below. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Hit that bell notification so you get notified the moment that I upload a video, guys. And let's stay green, guys. Thank you so much for watching.